we have found that there were enough violations of our policies and procedures. To make the ultimate decision, removing this 15-year law enforcement veteran, Jarda Bradford, from the Tampa Police Force. TPD tells Aid on Your Side Bradford did not cover a suspect's earrings in a photo lineup, which is required by the department. The police chief said she later went into the computer system and blacked out the earrings. The photo lineup was a part of a homicide investigation Bradford was a detective on in October. In a separate photo array, she put someone else's initials on it. So essentially forgery, and then you have the altering of another document. So you have two separate tampering of evidence charges. And we just can't have people breaking the law. But Bradford's attorney, Richard Escobar, argues this was a mistake. And the real question is... Was the mistake made with a criminal intent? Was there an intent in any way, shape, or form to obstruct justice? Uh, in this investigation, and I think the answer at the end of the day when we're finished with this case is going to be that, that it's not. He tells me Friday afternoon's decision to terminate his client came as no surprise. Uh, he made the statement that he was going to give her due process, but she was going to be fired. Escobar says her case will now be taken to the next level up, the state attorney's office. In an effort to hopefully uh, have him make a decision not to go forward with these charges. Authorities say Bradford is facing multiple felony charges of tampering with evidence, and we're going to continue to stay on top of her case. Live in Tampa, Olivia Steen, 8 on your side.